Here are some of the wire strippers I have. These are only the ones I could find in about 30 seconds. I have maybe 10 of these 5 inch strippers, some with springs and some without springs of numerous brands including Harbor Freight. I have at least two of these four-way strippers plus numerous needle nose and a couple of linesman pliers. I've also stripped wires using a pocket knife and even a cigarette lighter in a pinch. I've used them all from basic wire strippers all the way up to the Harbor Freight Doyle Heavy Duty Wire Stripper and Cutter currently priced at $25 on February 17th, 2021. Are the Doyle strippers worth talking about? Let's take a look at the reviews and see what you have told Harbor Freight about them, and I'll put in my two cents worth too. I'm Scott Bain, they call me the old farmer. Before I get started, the head office is complaining that I'm not pushing for subscriptions. Our viewership is well over 20,000 minutes, but we are well below what we need for subscribers in order to get a pittance from YouTube. We've already had to replace one camera, and the main one is about 15 years old. So if you could help us, we sure would appreciate it. Now on to the epistle. It's 18 degrees below zero Fahrenheit on my outdoor thermometer. It isn't much warmer inside the garage. So today's review will be quicker than a politician grabbing money. So let us proceed. Today we're looking at wire strippers. Anyone that can handle a screwdriver should have a pair of good wire strippers to do light electrical repairs, such as replacing electrical cords on appliances or to fix extension cords. These 5-inch cutters I've used for decades. If it's critical work, you can adjust the slide bolt for the proper wire gauge. You do need to know what you're doing with a pair like this. Some come with spring back wires, that automatically opens the cutters when you let go, some come without the wire. There are two schools of thought about whether there should be a spring on the cutters or not. I can use them either way, but they're known for nicking the wire if you're not careful. Needle nose and linesman pliers can work too, but I would say they are the hardest to use and it's difficult getting a good clean stripped wire. It can be done, I've done it, but I will look around first for anything else to strip a wire, even using a pocket knife. Next we have the four-way strippers. They work, but you could learn some new words that shouldn't be used in mixed company, such as around Republicans or Democrats. They may think these words are proper for using in public. Of all these strippers that I've mentioned so far, I prefer the 5 inch strippers, even though it's easy to nick a wire and they can dull easily. So what about the Harbor Freight Doyle Heavy Duty Wire Strippers and Cutter? How do they stack up to these other ways of stripping wires? 
Let's take a look and see what you told Harbor Freight about these strippers. First, five star reviews. I have not corrected for spelling nor syntax. Good price, easy to use, high quality at a great price. One week need to make a repair work, great on 16 gauge wire. Great stripper, I usually use another type and bought these expecting to hate them and throw them in the back of my toolbox. I was wrong. Now my co-worker and I fight over who will get to use them. I will definitely be buying another pair, probably two. Better for weak hands. Very easy to strip most wires if you have room for the tool. Work perfectly strip difficult wires without any problems. Saves time in tight spaces. Had some wiring work on my four-wheeler and it made it possible to do the job. There are no one or two star reviews, so let's jump to the only three star review posted to see what is being said. Not good for small wires. The strippers had space for small gauge wires, but it ripped and broke them instead of cleanly stripping them. Worked great on larger wires. I've had these Doyle strippers for about six months now. They strip wire beautifully. Even stranded wire comes out picture perfect when stripping 22 gauge wires, one of the smallest wires you would ever strip, comes out sharp and clean. I imagine that there could be a manufacturing flaw which caused the issue with small wires as mentioned in the previous review. The Doyle has wire cutters built in just above the spring and just below the hinge. For me, the spring can get in the way with cutting wires. I will instead have a pair of cutters with me so that I don't have to fool around with getting a wire in place for cutting. I wish they had used the type of spring found on typical 5 inch cutters. That would make it a more durable spring, which on the Doyle looks weak. It does however do what it's supposed to do as of now. I looked on the Harbor Freight website and so far there are no Doyle parts, so it might be a while before you can get replacement cutting blades for the Doyle wire strippers when the blades become dull. However, other brands have similar wire strippers and they may have replacement blades. It would be worth checking out. I would highly recommend the Doyle strippers for those who want an easy and accurate method for stripping wires. I will give them a five star rating. They are worth the money and make your work much, much easier. I will spare you the other 10,000 words that I could espouse about wire strippers, but I would imagine that I have covered the basics for most folks. Wouldn't you agree? Well, this is the old farmer Scott Payne. Be well. <laughs>